everybody welcome back to my channel life with patty so we're here with our weekly grocery haul and you know you're probably thinking patty you sure buy a lot of stuff for two people well you know what you are right and so i was talking with dawn she has her channel name is sensible living with money mom and there's three of them and they budget 75 dollars a week for all three so I told her, okay, I can't start out that low, but I could start out. I'm going to try really hard this week when I go to the grocery store to spend no more than $100. And I thought, no problem. My list isn't long and we don't need a whole lot. I'm going to stay under $100, right? Well, folks, I went to the town over because I wanted to go to the Dollar Tree because I wanted to see if they had all those Halloween cutouts that everybody's been hauling. So I went over there and then I told my husband, since I'm over there, I'm going to just go to Safeway because it's right next to the Dollar Tree, right? Well, I don't know how many of you have Safeway where you live, but where we have Safeway here is uh, a nicer store than Save No More, you know, Save More, uh, or Winco or Walmart. So let's put it to you this way. If you shopped your whole life at Walmart for everything, your groceries, your clothes, your shoes, everything. And then one day, somebody says, you wanna go shopping at Macy's? Woo! You find all kinds of sparkly, pretty things, and you want them all, right? <laughs> Safeway, Bel Air, Rayleigh's, and The Nugget. Those are the four nice grocery stores, around here anyway, in Northern California. But they're proud. They're proud, proud, proud people, you know, of their prices. So I knew, oh crud, I'm, it's going to be close to $100. Well, then they have all these wonderful things that you want that you can't get it to save no more. <laughs> the struggle is real, people. The struggle is real. All right, Patty, you just wasted two minutes. All right, let's get into this. <laughs> You'll see what I mean. And I went over budget. I went over budget. I spent more than $100. And uh, the guy made, set me up with a Safeway card. I saved $27, so that was good. But anyways, okay, here we go. So I needed cat litter for the kitties. And I got the, it's a big one. So it was $8.97, but it's bigger than the one I get at Dollar General most of the time. So I got that. And then I apparently they thought this family size corn pops wouldn't fit in a bag. So they just uh, left it out. <laughs> and uh, then I got my normal gallon of milk there that I always get. And I got my 12 pack of Coca-Cola. I love Coca. I love Coca-Cola. I used to be Pepsi and Pepsi only. And then one day we were out of Pepsi and my son had brought over a 12 pack of Coca-Cola or a 24 pack of Coca-Cola. I'm like, well, fine, I'll just have one. Now I'm hooked on Coke for some reason. I don't know. Now I say hooked. I don't do more than one a day, period. And some, the last 12 pack lasted me a month. So do the math. I don't have one every day. But every once in a while, I do like a fuzzy over ice. You know what I'm saying? Ooh. All right. Let's see. Okay. So here we go. What things that I didn't need that weren't on our list. But you're like, hmm. So they had Blue Bunny ice cream. I know they carry Blue Bunny at Walmart too, but um, I, we've never had Blue Bunny. So I thought we'd try it. It's the banana split one. We'll try it and see. Then they had these beautiful, oh shoot. Oh, my husband will eat them all. I got the Italian sausage. I didn't notice I got the hot. This girl's wimpy. I can't do hot. Oh, I'm so sad. Well, I guess he'll get them because I can't do hot. So then I'm gonna make a um, enchilada casserole. So I got the Mexican style three cheese blend, four cheese blend. And I had some a cheese here at home still, but I was like, oh my gosh. I don't know, I've had it for a while. What if it's not good? Then I gotta go all the way back to town. So I just got a little. And then at that store, they have the, um, oh, in the deli section, the tomato basil bisque. Oh, so good. I want some right now. 
so good, but I'm gonna save this for my lunch. This will be two lunches. So good. And then yesterday I was gonna make the enchilada casserole, got the hamburger out and everything, and then I didn't have any enchilada sauce. So I didn't wanna go back to town for enchilada sauce. So we just had hamburgers, but then I used part of the hamburger mix, so I had to get more hamburger <laughs> so I could make the casserole. Oh my gosh. We were out of ham. So I got some ham. And then I got another one of these um, hamburgers because everybody's been making tacos lately and it makes me want to have tacos. I want tacos. So I'm going to go put this stuff away because it's a hot tamale outside right now. And then I'll be back. Okay, I've ordered up. Where did we go? They had these beautiful brioche buns. Mm. So I have frozen hamburger patties that we've been eating down that when my son came from Montana, all the brothers, when he comes, my other sons all come over and we have big barbecues. They got way too many hamburgers last time. So we have them in the freezer. We've just been picking them off and having a couple, you know, here and there once in a while. So two of these buns will be for hamburgers and I'll show you what the other four are gonna be for in a minute. And then, of course, I got my normal buttermilk bread that I get every time I go. And then they had these artisan sausage rolls that I got the Italian sausage for that I now can't eat. I mean, I'll try one. Maybe with the bread, it'll sop up some of the hot uh, spiciness. But, yeah, I'm telling you what, I am wimpy. I mean, my kids are like, Mom, ketchup is not hot. I don't say it is, but they exaggerate, you know, because I think everything's hot. Okay, so, and my eggs. We well, go through a lot of eggs, I tell you. So I saw these there and I, uh, I've i never seen them before. So I got these Twinkies with chocolate over the top. So I thought Ryder could try these for a, um, a taste test. And his mother will be like, that's all we need. <laughs> and then uh, I love Life Cereal. This was in the produce section, you know, on an end cap because it was on sale. And I'm like, okay. So truth be known, I probably didn't need cereal at all this week. You saw I got the corn pops, then I got that. But you know, wait, there's one more. And you know, why do I do that? Because I'll think, oh, well, maybe we'll run out. We're not gonna run out of cereal, but I still got it. And then I think it was Fatima, fabulous Fatima, who was making tacos. So that's why I got the hamburger and these because then she got me craving the tacos. You know, I want tacos. And then I'm going to make a recipe with, uh, to, with, to make cookies and they're proud of their proud, proud people, you know, <laughs> we have gone over that, of uh, their chocolate chips. So I've never even heard of this brand. They look like they're trying to copy the Ghirardelli logo, but this is not Ghirardelli. And, um, it was on sale. So I'm like, Hey, a, ch a chocolate chip is a chocolate chip, right? So that's what we got. And then, oh Lord, have mercy on my soul. I told Debbie I wasn't going to buy any more of those Krispy Kreme fruit pies because they're too high in calories. Yeah, I don't want them all. Um, but, you know, this is because of my dad, okay? This has nothing to do with my grocery haul. Well, kind of does for this because I bought some of these. These were just the signature select so it's like the Safeway brand but they were on sale for 49 cents and um so my dad when we were growing up I always remember my dad my mom made dinner every single night always made dinner and as four kids my mom and my dad and sometimes my grandma because my grandma lived with us sometimes would all sit down every single night for dinner together we always did and um after dinner my dad would always say dearie you got any dessert material and so we do the same thing. We have a little dessert afterwards. So they had the blackberry. They had the cherry. They had the apple. And they had the lemon. So there's four nights of dessert, right? Okay, and you know, I told you we had enough cereal, right? Yeah, well, um... 
I love rice checks. I don't eat it for breakfast. I eat it for lunch or for a snack or for dessert, but I got it. I don't know what to tell you. I just got it. Okay, here's my husband's normal yogurts that he gets every single week because he likes yogurt in the morning for his breakfast. I think I've got him seven. Yeah. There's another one. And I've never seen these before, you guys. Uh, soup it up. It's a cup of noodles, but it's called soup it up. Like it's a little more, uh, you know, like it has a little more. This is the roasted chicken flavor. So I got that one. They were a dollar. So that's a little pricey compared to the other ones that are like 33 cents. But I just wanted to try one. Ranch dressing. I got two because I don't know why. Because I figured that I won't have to buy it for a couple of weeks. <laughs> And I got corn tortillas for the enchilada casserole I'm going to make. And baby carrots. And we were out. Okay. And I got uh, broccoli. We love broccoli. And I got more tomatoes. I don't know if I told you guys, but my tomato plants... I don't know, it was like a white fly or something got into them and killed them all. So I just said the heck with it. Next year will be another year. We'll try it again. And my husband says I need to change out the soil that I've had that same soil there for a while. So, okay. Um, we, we both like these for a snack every once in a while. Just, uh, you want just a little something. We have those. And then, so here is the seasoned shredded beef and original barbecue sauce. So, this will make each of us um, dinner It'll, for both of us on those brioche buns. So that's two more of the buns we're gonna use that for. So, oh, here's the other cup of noodles. It was a uh, savory shrimp flavor. So I'm gonna try those. I've never had them. I've had the other ones, but not the soup to that. And then, I don't know. Because I, I was at the checkout stand. All right, last bag, you guys. Last bag. And then you know what I'm hoping? I'm hoping next week I'm a good girl. I just go to the Save No More and spend $100 or less. That's my goal. Okay. Oh, asparagus. We love asparagus. Safeway does such a nice job of they've got it all clean. They've got it all cut. That's, you know, you kind of do pay for what you get. And they had these wonderful five cheese tortellinis. Oh, I love this. And I have some, um, oh my gosh, I don't know. The green, um, the green stuff, you know? Oh my God, that's going to bug me. I'll tell you in a minute. Okay, so we got the cottage cheese with the pineapple. I've never had this lucerne. I think this is the... Um, are through Safeway. I've never had it, but I'm sure it'll be fine. And I got the imitation crab. We like it, just chopped up in the salad. And this was for the last two brioche buns is the pulled pork and barbecue sauce. So these are easy meals I can do when I get home. Pesto sauce, that's the green stuff. <laughs> the green stuff for my tortellini. I have pesto sauce in the refrigerator. So I can make that one night, I can make the pulled pork, and I can make the pulled beef. Um, and those are super fast, easy meals for when I get home so I don't have to like be slaving or, you know, busting my hump over the, um, over the stove, you know what I'm saying? So, okay. And then I got two things of enchilada sauce because I needed one and I thought I better get two because the last time I thought I had it and I didn't. So now I got one for the pantry. Um, we always love linguisa and we were out. And the last thing I got were these snacking cheese Asiago. I love Asiago cheese. And so those will be good for a snack. So anyways, that was my grocery haul, you guys. Now guess what I gotta do? I gotta go put it all away. So, all right, you guys, next week, I'm really gonna try really hard 
to be a good girl and stay at $100. That's what my goal is. I, I'm going to stay at $100. And then I'm going to try to just do $100 a week. We'll see. So I fall off the boat real fast, you know. So, okay. <laughs> you guys have a great day, and I'll see you again tomorrow. Bye, guys.